outfits for day two of the braid. I just put a ponytail. I mean, I have been on it because I'm over it and I'm washing my hair tonight so that I can be done with it. We're up in the room. And hey, man, these things are getting fancier by the year, I swear. First fill that. Uh -huh. Hi guys, we are once again getting gas. Um Getting gas is like a three times a week occurrence since I have to drive so far with school. And I know you guys are like, we haven't done anything fun yet. You haven't showed us anything. I can't show you guys class, which sucks, unfortunately. And it's like my school ends super early this year. Like, this is literally the last week of class. And then we just have one day next week. So it's just like, I don't have anything to show you. And I can't, obviously, you know, disrespect everyone's consent and preferences by recording in class and then like four hours of my day is driving usually <laughs> but you know what whenever I get to Costco and there's someone just like lost and like mixing up the whole like flow of things I always feel so bad for them because everyone at Costco is like <laughs> like they literally will beat you up if you don't like fill in the spot right away they'll be like honking at you i don't know maybe it's the specific costco costco because my other one is not really like that there's a few people that will be but this lady was just super confused and it's like she was scared to go in in the middle and so she was like hesitating and then people were like honking and it's like chill i just filled up for 29.35 guys gas is 269 which it literally hasn't been that low in ever like since probably the beginning of the pandemic um but yeah that's why we haven't done anything fun yet but don't worry i have so much things planned so many things lots of things and also i gave my friends their christmas gifts today but I didn't want to show you guys because I didn't want to ruin the moment and be like, hey, can I record your reaction? Like, I was not going to do that. And one of my friends actually got really teary-eyed and was like on the verge of tears. So I was like, I cannot put that on the internet. Ugly crying as if we don't go through enough in nursing school. And then one of my friends, I didn't get to see her for the rest of the day because we um, split up. We're in different groups. We had clinical evaluations today, which is basically just what they tell you how you've done at clinical and... I passed, thankfully, I mean, you know, and my other friend, so I didn't get to see her, she wrote me a very long, sweet text message, um, and yeah, I think we're all kind of getting sentimental, because we know it's going to be our last, like, week together for the next four weeks, which is weird, we've spent the last 16 weeks together, um, but yeah, now we're going to drive home, we need to go to Dollar Tree, because I need to get some cups, because we're having a potluck in class on Friday, um, and then there's also something else I need to get, but now I can't remember. Look at my eyebrows. We're going to do these tonight. I'll see you guys at home. Hi, guys. We are home now. I am so tired. I'm going to take a nap. I've been tired since I woke up. I was struggling to stay awake on the drive this morning, but obviously I did. On the way back, it was easier to take a nap in between classes and my evaluation. Let's open up our gift today. This one's safe while I'm nervous. We're opening up. Look at that. Clock clip. Christmas clock clip. Clock clip Christmas. These, ironically, were the clock clips my mom told me she wasn't giving me. <laughs> But she told me I could wear them. And so I referred to them in our Duluth video. If you've watched the video number one or two. Um, but yeah, they're just really cute little Christmassy themed claw clips. Snowflake, gingerbread Santa, gingerbread house, and a hat. This one kind of reminds me of Cartman's hat, even though I don't like South Park. Um, but yay, 
that's very cute. And you'll definitely be seeing more of these throughout Vlogmas. I obviously have a braid in, so I can't clock with my braid. But when I wash my hair tonight, um, I will show you guys how it looks, how they look. But wow, very pleasant surprise. That is a very good number five day claw clip. Now I can wear them with all my Christmas sweaters and add a little spice and some festive ones. Which one's your favorite? I really love the gingerbread house. It's so just cute and detailed. But I'm going to go take a nap. I will see you guys after my nap. Guys, we're at the point in the day where it is called prepare for finals. So we're going to go through and make a bunch of our note cards just on the last few sections of the things that we've read. Then I have some note cards I need to finish. Then we're going to go through them one time. Um, obviously, I'm not going to show you guys that because I have a ton of note cards. It take like an hour, but I'll do a little time lapse for you guys. Um, and basically start finishing up the last. So our test and I guess like semester was split up into three different sections for our class that's called theory and basically one test included you know the 15 chapters the next class included so I'm gonna be done with our third chunk then I need to go back to the first chunk and find my old note cards that I made on those like throughout the year and then also make some new ones um just of, like other things that they've mentioned and talked about um throughout the year it's a lot. It's a lot of work. And at the end, I'm going to have probably two million note cards. Um, but that's okay because that gets A's. And then we have to do some practice questions on our website. That's directly attached to our book, which sometimes our teachers pull questions from. Um, and then after that, I think we need a response to some discussion post. But let's start with this and get working. But all I have left is to finish these note cards. I know it seems like a lot, but it's literally nothing. Um, it'll take like 30 minutes. And then we're going to get in the shower, wash my hair. Um, my mom might do my eyebrows. And honestly, we should clean up my room. I'm just debating. Because I don't want to. <laughs> But we should, and in the long run, it is the best thing to go into the final week with a clean room and a clean space. But I don't want to do it. But okay, let me finish these. I will come back to you guys. Um, and I also have to still finish editing and uploading yesterday's video. I'm slacking really bad. Um... So I will also do that tonight. So maybe after eyebrows and room clean, that'll probably be the end of this vlog since I literally have to do two full vlogs tonight again. Hey guys, time to fill up our nightly water. I drink 80 ounces today. Well, I mean, give or take those few ounces down there. So, I don't know, 76. But this is our ice that we filled up yesterday. And the one thing that I love about my Simply Modern and Stanley's is that two of these big chunkers can literally last for two days. Okay, let me fill my water. This one was half filled from earlier there we go and then we refill these 
Alrighty guys. Alrighty guys, these are my eyebrows before. They're pretty full and they're not bad, but something about a sleek eyebrow does it for me personally every time. And you guys are gonna see the after. Oh my gosh, look at all my freckles. <laughs> guys, this is the finished result of the eyebrows. They're a little thin, I'm not gonna lie. And it's kind of weird to see myself with eyebrows this thin again, because I haven't in quite some time. And the last time we did my eyebrows, we kept them a little thicker. More so what I would call medium. Um, and I think I'm going to go back to medium once these go back in. But I don't hate them. It's just, this is how I used to always have my eyebrows, like, literally for like a decade. I started getting my eyebrows done really early in life because I had a unibrow in like third grade. <laughs> so probably more than a decade. Um... But this is how they always used to like, and I used to love it so much. But I think I'm a medium girl. I'll show you guys a picture of me with medium, so I'm going to call it. Um, and you guys can be the judge.